Tyson Foods teams up with the World Economic Forum to open an insect processing plant. <laughs> That's right. You got mainstream media trying to pretend like they're not trying to move us towards eating bugs. And, and, and they caping for the WEF and, and uh, Klaus Schwab and, 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 and Bill Gates and the rest of the New World Order elites. Uh, they cape and form and pretending like, oh, no one's really saying we're going to make y'all eat bugs and all this other stuff. But at the same time, they're telling you to eat bugs. This is crazy. Like, we can't believe our own ears and eyes. Um, and this is crazy. So now Tyson is stepping up to help them process these bugs that they want to move us into eating. It's just, this is disgusting. Um, but before we get started, go ahead and hit that like button. Share this out so we can get this information out there. Subscribe if you're not already a subscriber. And hit that alarm bell so you know when I'm putting out new stuff. Also, check out my link tree in the description. It has a link to my Patreon where I talk about things I can't talk about here. There's also a link to my Instagram. Uh, check that out as well um, where I'm, I'm putting out more and more news and stuff on Instagram because I had put out some memes a while back that end up getting censored and it kind of pissed me off. And anytime I get censored, it make me work that much harder. So now I'm putting out even more news on Instagram. So check out JJ, the psychotherapist on Instagram as well. Also, um, JJ, the psychotherapist.com for news, um, and more information there. All right, let's talk about this news. In case you're wondering, corporate America has gone so far to the dark side that they might never find their way back. Just like science, medicine, education, and the military, U.S. corporations have gone woke, eagerly carrying the torch for progressive globalists determined to turn the world into a dystopian, bug-infested nightmare for the average person. Meanwhile, the global elites will continue to jet around on private planes, savor the finest cuts of red meat, and sip champagne through plastic straws. Clearly, the rules only apply to us lowly commoners. One such turncoat corporation is Tyson Foods, a company many of us have, many of us likely support on a weekly, if not daily basis. Tyson is based in the very red Springdale, Arkansas. Tyson Food is a key player in the food industry and the world's second largest processor and marketer of chicken, beef, and pork. Soon, they aim to be the world's leading producer of insect-based food, whether you like it or not. In a move ripped straight from the pages of a dystopian uh, horror novel, um, horror novel, sorry, uh, Tyson Foods is now partnering with Ghouls, Klaus Schwab, uh, in the World Economic Forum cronies to establish an insect processing plant likely coming to a city near you. And Slay News report that Tyson Food Inc., the largest producer in the U.S. for all kinds of meats, is buying a stake in the Netherlands-based insect protein company Protix BV. Protix BV describes itself, quote, as leading the world in the technical aspects of insect production can't make this stuff up and the company has also been hailed by the world economic forum and was awarded with globalist organizations technic uh, technology pioneer award protex ceo keys arts is also uh, listed as a member of the world economic forum of course the two companies will collaborate to establish a manufacturing facility in the u.s the new plant will produce bug-based meal and oil typically used in fish feed and dog food. However, Tyson CFO John Tyson said in an interview that, quote, in the long run, the company will produce products that are good for people. I'm sure. So insects are going to be good for people. Quote, it's a billion dollar industry opportunity that has tremendous growth potential. And we see Protex as being a leader there, Tyson said. Tyson added that, quote, insect protein inclusion can be beneficial to both the planet and animals. The globalists won't rest until they've gotten every American grilling bug burger every 4th of July. Our best defense is to clean house in our own party, voting out every rhino and replacing them with America First warriors ready to demolish the left's radical agenda. Otherwise, you can kiss your ribeye good goodbye and prepare for a cockroach steak. But let me know what you think. Leave your comments down below. Like, share, subscribe, and check out JJ the Psychotherapist and Instagram. Um, 
JJ the Psychotherapist.com and Instagram. Until next time, peace.